Hey, my name is Math Prodigy. This is Coach Saiful with your daily dose of math mastery. And today we're going to go into question number two of your assessment paper number three, which is on circles, which is pretty, 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 pretty simple. Okay, so I'm um, going to look at the question immediately. Let's not waste time. Let's go into the questions immediately. The question says this: two semicircles. Now, what is a semicircle? A semicircle is basically half of a circle. So two semicircles each of diameter 7 cm are cut from the corners of a rectangular cardboard as shown in the figure. Uh, what is the perimeter of the remaining piece of cardboard? Okay, so first off you need to understand one thing. A semicircle is basically half of a circle. So if you have two semicircles, it gives you what? If you put them together, take a look at this. The, um, this and this, this and this are actually the same semicircles because they are of the, the same diameter, which is 7 cm. So if you were to put this on top of this, you will get one whole circle, okay? So why am I saying that? It's because if you want to find the, the circumference of this whole circle, you can easily take um, 2 pi r. Instead of taking 2 pi r, divide by 2 for one semicircle, okay? Um, I hope I'm not, I'm not uh, confusing you. I hope you got it. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm just gonna do this um, a bit slower than normal, so that because we are very new in this topic, so let's do this part. So first off, you need to understand the 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 question. The question asks you for perimeter. Perimeter basically means the addition of the sides, the outside. So basically, this thing here to here and to here and all the way here. So the question is, what is the perimeter of the remaining piece of cardboard? So Basically, all you have to do is take is to find this, which is 8 cm, right? To find this part of the rectangle, which is 17 cm minus what? What is the diameter of the circle? It's 7. So 17 minus 7 gives you 10. So 8 plus 10 plus 10 plus 8 will give you the, the straight sides. Now, what we need to do, understand, uh, what we need to get next is actually the circumference of the circle. So the circumference of this part of the semicircle and the circumference of this another part. Okay, so I'm gonna do this step by step. I'm gonna do it by a semicircle, uh, by, by semicircles. Okay, so let's look for the perimeter. Step one, perimeter of semicircle one. I'm just gonna call it perimeter of semicircle one. Is equals to what? The perimeter of any circle is two pi r. So if it's a semicircle, that means you have to divide it by what? By 2, correct. So you get pi times r. In this case, they ask us to take pi r, pi as 22 over 7. So 22 over 7, and what's the radius? Don't get confused, yeah? The, the radius is not 7. The radius is actually what? The radius is actually 3.5. Why? Because, take a look again, it says the diameter is 7 cm. That means from one end of the circle to the other end of the circle is 7 cm. But from the circle to the center part of the circle, which is the origin, is actually divided by 2. So that gives you 3.5 cm. So how do you get the answer? It's very simple. Uh, 22 over 7 divided by 3.5. You cancel this. You cancel this. You will have 1 is 2. 2. 22 divided by 2 gives you 11. So the answer is 11 cm squared. For semicircles, okay, for that semicircle. So therefore, perimeter sorry, it's eleven cm squared. Eleven cm. This is not area. Eleven cm. So therefore, perimeter of two semicircles is going to give you what? Simple, right? Eleven times two. Eleven times two, which gives you twenty-two. Okay. Alternatively, you can just add them up separately. So if you don't want to do this, it's up to you. But I would do it this way. Now just add up the side. So 22 plus, let's take a look at the figure again. 22 plus 8 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10. So 22 plus 8 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10. 22 plus 8 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10. Yep, correct. 22 plus 8 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10. And that will give you the answer of 10, 20, um, 40, 58 cm. And that is the perimeter of the um, remaining piece of cardboard. Simple, very, very simple. Now, if you want, to sh uh, want me to show you a bit more of how, to, how I got these answers, um, how I got 10 was simply 17 minus the diameter, which gives you the side, which is 10 cm. The other thing that you might want to note is you can also do it in a different way. In other words, you can just take 8 plus 8 plus 10 plus 10 plus 11 plus 11, which gives you the same answer of 58 cm. Alright, so let's check the answer 10, 20, 30, 40, 
42 plus uh, 16, therefore gives you 58. We are right. So that's it. Circles is very simple, isn't it? Very, very simple. So again, my quote of the week for you is to believe in you. Like I said before, no amount of preparation is going to uh, help you if you don't believe in yourself. So believe in you. you already done the work. Who has done the work is you. Remember who you are. And with that, this is Coach Saifo signing off. You are a math prodigy. Good job.